I've been spending the last several days of my shows, mm -hmm. honestly, the last months of my shows, talking about big tech and talking mm -hmm. about how they censor vaccine critical information, how they censor conservative voices, they censor Donald Trump, people that they just quite frankly don't like. Mm -hmm. What boggles my mind is that they tell us that they can't get rid of the child porn in the internet. They can't get rid of that. You can get rid of all the COVID misinformation, somebody being critical or explaining a very real world situation whether they had a vaccine side effect. That's mm -hmm. deemed bad for the public well-being. No. But they're telling us they really can't cleanse all this filth from the internet. They can. So they, they hide it under the guise of privacy and encryption, right? And they spend millions, if not billions of dollars, lobbying Congress to protect the privacy of people. Meanwhile, they can see everything that we say. They know everything that we do. Every single thing that we think, we look at, we Google, we search is exploited and sold for advertisements and dollars. They, they know everything that we do. They even know your eye movement as you look at the phone and what makes you pay attention, when to send you notifications and what notification to send you to keep you glued to it. They know. But the problem is, is that if they acknowledged how bad child exploitation has become and trafficking has become, if they allowed the police to do what they need to do to get around the encryption and to get through all of these mechanisms that they, the predators use to get to our children, then they could be held liable in court.